Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is going to be my second video of my fall series for this upcoming fall 2020. I'm going to be sharing the second part of my fall decor haul. All of this decor is from Hobby Lobby and then I do have three random pieces from Big Lots that I'll share at the end of the video. But what I was going for was mostly getting stuff for my tiered tray and to decorate my dining room. So if you guys are interested in seeing all of the items that I got from Hobby Lobby, make sure you watch this video all the way through. Right now they do have all of their fall decor 40% off, so you're going to pay pretty good prices right now. I think they typically always have that sale going on up until through fall, so definitely go hit up Hobby Lobby and you're going to find all of your fall needs. Before we jump into this video, make sure you hit that red subscribe button down below and join the Boss Bomb Hustle Tribe. I would love to have you a part of my family. My earrings are super dangly, so you might hear them kind of ding, ding, ding the whole video, but they're really, really pretty earrings. I actually got these at Walmart on clearance for $2, so super good steal. But anyways, back into all of the fall madness and let's dive right into the video. Okay guys, the very first thing that I'm gonna show you is a really cute sign that I'm going to hang up in my dining room. The colors match perfectly. If you guys are new to my videos, I have kind of like a, a greenish farmhouse color for my dining room walls and I really absolutely love that color and it's just so funny that that's like the theme that people go with a lot of like the whites and that like off green. I don't even know what the the technical color is for it it's it's like a green though it's not teal but it has like that light olive green color to it so most of my color scheme that I wanted to go for in my dining room was that kind of green with the whites and some like soft brown tones and maybe a hint of black I don't think I really got much black going on in the dining room but that's kind of the color scheme I was wanting to go with, especially for my tiered tray that I'm gonna put on my dining table. So the first sign that I grabbed, I think this is actually the only sign that I got. Um, I know, I think they actually had this last year. They also have it in orange, but it's this really cute Autumn Acres pumpkin patch sign. So they also have the pumpkins in orange, but this literally, you guys, is almost like identical to the colors that is my dining room walls mine might be a little bit more towards the teal this might be a more softer green but it literally matches almost perfectly so i want to hang this up in my dining room it originally is 19.99 it was on sale for 40 percent off so i want to say i paid like 11 or 12 bucks for it but it's it's a big sign so i saw that i grabbed this and i can't wait to hang this up i already know the spot i want to put it I also picked up a new table runner again it has those very pretty colors in it and what I really liked about this if I don't want to have the white side with the pumpkin I can switch it to the the plaid so that's that really pretty color and the pumpkin is on the end of each side of it but I really liked the white I feel like the white was gonna really pop out and pull a lot of focus to the table which is what I'm going for since I'm gonna be having my my tray decorated but I thought this was really pretty. They had so many different styles um, and the different color schemes for the fall for this year. But I really liked this one. I saw it and it kind of just kind of jumped into my cart. I also grabbed this really cute little picture frame here. It does have the back like this. You can't hang it up so it's like a tabletop little frame. I thought it was really cute, pretty color. I think I might hang it on my shelf in the dining room. Then I grabbed this super cute little galvanized house. You can put your little tea light candle in there. I've been wanting one of these. These are always kind of a little pricey to me too. It was $9.99 but 40% off so I think I paid like five or six bucks for it. And it's a pretty big little house. I don't know exactly where I want to put this. I don't even know if it'll probably go in my dining room. I'm thinking maybe on my TV stand and kind of spruce it up a little bit with some little cute greenery or whatever around it. But I thought it was really cute. And they had a couple different sizes of these. I grabbed these little beadery here. So this actually all ties in, which I liked that. So this will go for my tiered tray. And on it, it just says gather. It has that really pretty green along with the soft wood tones that I'm going for. These are really cute. They had a couple different styles of these. You can get these beads at Hobby Lobby just like the plain wood. I know that's like a trending thing right now. These are very easy to spruce up an area with just pops of like the, the beadery. Is that how it's called? Beadery? I'm just making up my own words apparently. I don't even think that's a real word but we're just gonna go with it. But 
I grabbed this. I think I might go back and actually get me another one. Maybe just try to find like just the all wood one where I can use it all year round. I mean, I feel like I could use this all year round too, but I really liked it for my tear tray. I also grabbed more pumpkins, you guys, because I needed some pumpkins to go in my tiered tray because the other ones that I got in my Dollar General haul, I think I'm most likely gonna use those in that galvanized bowl that I had got. But I picked up a bag of these ones. So it has that pretty burnt orange in there along with the, the I think this is, these might be white. I think the other ones I had grabbed were more like um, cream off white and then those pretty green pumpkins. So I grabbed these. These were $9.99 originally, but 40% off again. So I think it was like five something. And then I just grabbed a bag of the all white. So there are a variety of different sizes. Then I grabbed this pumpkin by itself because I'm going to put it in. Hopefully it fits now that I have it. But uh, my little lantern that I got from Dollar General, I'm planning to set this in here. And I got some really cute green here I'm gonna show you in a second to kind of place around and I just really thought that it would be a cute little statement piece. These were $6.99, again, 40% off. So a couple of different greenery that I got, I just got these two little stem pieces. Um, the greenery that they had that wasn't fall was not 40% off, so I steered clear of that, but this was actually marked fall, so it was 40%. They were $3.99 each, so they were like two bucks or a little over two dollars. So I got two of these, and I'm gonna kind of show you what I mean. Like, when I decorate it, I'm thinking of kind of placing it like this. You get my, you get my drift? <laughs> That's the idea that I had with that. And then I did grab two of these. These kind of have those cute little pine cones on it. These are just little floral picks. I thought these were really pretty. So I got two of these to kind of place maybe in my tray or somewhere. Then I grabbed two things of hay. This one that I'm going to actually show you, I actually bought at Big Lots for 10 bucks. And I honestly think it's about the same size. I did get another one of these at Hobby Lobby. It was 14 I paid 40% off. Um, but that one's in my trunk still, but I did just grab this one from Big Lots when I grabbed the other things. Um, I'm thinking of using these by my fireplace along with my little vision. I have something, something in my head. We'll see how it goes together. You guys will hear a tank. He's in the next room playing the game, so you're going to hear him like laughing. He's kind of laughing like a witch. <laughs> but this is the only time I can record this video. I've tried it multiple times and in real life you're going to hear some kids. There might be some screaming. You guys get the drill. You guys are not new to the craziness. So the next items that I'm gonna show you guys are all for my tiered tray. So I just got some little knits and knacks for my tiered tray. Lots of cute little things. They're so tiny and they're just so adorable. But before I show you those, I just realized that I had another bag of pumpkins that I forgot to show. These are some velvet pumpkins. This blue is so pretty. It doesn't match anything else I have going on, but I really wanted the pine cones and the little cute little white velvet pumpkins, but I really think that that blue is a really pretty color. But these were $7.99, 40% off. Now I'll show you everything that I got for my tiered tray. I grabbed this cute little thankful pumpkin, little distressed pumpkin. It was $2.99. I think it was like a dollar or something after 40% off. So you can either hang it up, but I'm going to use this for my tiered tray. Then I grabbed this cute little gather pumpkin. This is not actually going to go on my tiered tray. If you watch my Dollar General haul, my um, pot holders and all that were that very pretty blue. So I saw this. I got this after I actually went to Dollar General. This was $4.99, 40% off. But I'm going to use this probably in my kitchen, maybe on my coffee bar somewhere, since it has that pretty blue. I grabbed this cute little sign here. These were $2.99. They had a couple different styles of um, these little signs, but I loved that it was that nice little soft wood. And the little buffalo plaid, you guys know I love buffalo check. Just a little candle stand here. It's that really pretty green. These were $2.99, so about half off of that. They had so many colors of these. I actually have a couple of these already from like Target Dollar Spot. They literally look identical, but I really loved that this color matched my dining room and everything else that I was going with, so I grabbed one of these. 
I grabbed this super adorable cutting board. This little baby cutting board, a little mini board. This was $3.99. Came out to like two something. How cute is this, you guys? This is just so cute. This little, little soft, adorable mug here. I love that it has the little black rim and it's white. And with that, I have these cute little wooden spoons. I'm going to put these inside my um, little mug here to go on my tier tray. It's going to be so cute. I can't wait to show you guys that. When I was actually checking out the two ladies at the register, they were like, oh my gosh, these are so cute. They're so little. And you got a little cutting board. I was like, I know. I wanted to buy everything I seen. Every little mini thing I seen, I wanted to buy. But I grabbed these for my tier tray as well. So I think that was everything for my tier tray. Now I'm gonna show you guys the couple things that I got from Big Lots. The very first thing that I got from Big Lots was this cute little buffalo check pumpkin. I thought this was super cute. It was $8, a little bit more than what I would have wanted to spend, but I still didn't think it was really that bad price. I do have a couple other buffalo check pumpkins from last year. This is gonna go in my living room. I'm gonna kind of stick with that farmhouse more themed with my living room since I have a lot of stuff from last year for it. So I grabbed that little cute little pumpkin. Then I got this truck. I was going back and forth. I was like, I don't know if I want to buy it because it was a little bit more than what I typically would have wanted to spend. But it was just so cute, you guys. And what I really liked about it is even though it has like the little fall pumpkins and all of that, I could just pop them out, place it in to switch it up for like Christmas, spring or whatever else holiday I plan to use it for. But how adorable is this? It was $20. I was steep. And like I said, I kept putting it back, picking it back up, putting it back, and then finally I'm like, I'm just gonna go for it because I'll, I'll get uses out of it. But it's so cute. It has the pumpkins, the ears lamb in there. Super pretty. I love the black. But I think typically, again, I wouldn't spend $20, but I decided to splurge a little. And it looks like these are just in like the foam. So like I said, I can I can pop the pumpkins out and switch out um, different decor for it based on the season or holiday I'm decorating for. Now the last thing I got was a rug for my kitchen. It's that very pretty blue that I'm absolutely in love with that I'm noticing it's in almost every store that I've went in. I don't know if it's like, I don't even know what type of blue it is, but it's so pretty, so pretty. But this was $14. And it just says grateful, thankful, blessed. And I feel like it will look very good underneath my stove where I have my cute kitchen rags hanging. But this was $14. They had a couple other different rugs. They were, I think, 12 bucks. So this was a little bit more. But the other ones were more geared towards like outdoor rugs. And this one is like that chef's, it's that foamy thick kind so when you're standing on it kind of gives you a little cushion and support so that sums up today's video you guys that was everything that i got so lots of decor for my dining room and a couple of ends for my kitchen and living room i'm so excited to share my decorating videos with you those are probably gonna be the next videos that i push out since i have all the decor i need so make sure you guys hit that red subscribe button so you don't miss out on those videos because it's going to be lots of very good inspiration to get you guys pumped and ready to decorate your home for fall. If you guys are tuning in for the first time, please make sure you join my family. Check out some of my other videos and I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye!